Today, I got this question from a CartFlows user, and they were simply asking how on their e-commerce site can they see and experience what their customer sees and experience? Because when you have a WordPress login, you're the admin, but a lot of times if you're building a learning management system type of website, or if you're using BuddyBoss and you're building a social network website, or any kind of website where someone's gonna have an account and log in, you want to experience what they're gonna experience just to double check everything and make sure it's the experience you want them to have. I'm gonna show you how to do that in this video. It's super easy. Hi, my name is Adam from WPCrafter.com where I make WordPress tutorial videos like this one for non-techies like me and maybe like you. If you're new here, consider clicking on the subscribe button. Let's hop into it. All right, here I am. What we're gonna do is go to plugins, hover over add new and click on that. And over on the right, let's just do a search for user switching. And there we have it. User switching is the plugin that we're gonna install. It's so easy to use. So click on install now, then click on activate. And all right, that's it, video over. Uh, of course, I'm just just kidding. Let me show you how to use it now because when you activated it, you probably didn't notice anything different. It's super easy. Now, what we want to do is go over to where our users are right here. I'm going to click on all users. And on this page, I have a list of users registered on my website. Now I'm logged in as the admin. You can see right here, my name is CartFlows for this. And when you hover over any of these other user accounts, I don't know if you noticed that there's a new option there. So here under this user account, this is a buyer. You can see right there, it says switch to. So when I click on switch to, watch what happens. Now I am logged in to this website as that user. You can see here's their username right here. It put me right into the My Account dashboard, which is because I have WooCommerce on this site. It just kicked me right in there. I love this. And now you can totally test the experience as this particular user. It's going to be great for debugging access to things and it's really one of those plugins you might want to always keep on your website. Now, the next thing you should be asking is now, how do I get back into my admin account? Don't worry about that. I'm going to show you how right now. Check this out. When you scroll down to the bottom, just like that, you might see it here on the bottom left. And obviously mine's orange because of the settings of my theme. You can see I'm using orange here. I'm using the cadence theme. It's awesome. Uh, but anyways, right here, it says switch back to the admin account, which is named cart flows so yours will say something different so when I click on this it should kick me out of the account I was in and then put me back into the admin account and then I can get right back into WordPress right here and if I go back into users you can easily switch to any user you want this way and that's how you do it it was so easy right now keep one thing in mind if you happen to use the buddy boss theme and the buddy boss framework I do I love it they actually built this functionality into it because it's such a crucial component of building a social network website to be able to like debug things. Now, if you're using LearnDash or Lifter LMS or WooCommerce, this is probably one of those must have plugins on your website so you can see what the customer sees, especially if they're sending you a ticket and saying, I don't have access to this. I don't understand how this works. You can log in and see exactly what they're experiencing. You don't have to ask them for their password. You don't have to have dummy accounts on your site, just one clips super convenient you're in to your website as one of these users now if you think this can help you give this video a thumbs up because that's going to help me on this channel here on youtube if you're not subscribed hit that subscribe button hit the notification bell what are you waiting for i won't pester you i'm just putting out videos that i hope will help you have a smoother experience building out your wordpress website if you have any questions ask in the comment section down below thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one